I'm just like a lot of things have kind of been brought more into focus over the past day or so. Like how, how different we are. When it comes to marriage, when it comes to faith, when it comes to lifestyle, I mean, I'm just being honest and I just got more of a sight into life outside of this and just, yeah, how different it all is. Madison Pruitt was a finalist on one of the most unforgettable seasons of The Bachelor. Season 24, a broken engagement that led bachelor Peter Weber back to Madison. In the end, it didn't work out, but Madison says that she learned a lot from the experience, though, much of which is in her new book called Made for This Moment, Standing Firm with Strength, Grace, and Courage. She joins us this morning. Madison, hello there. Nice to have you with us. Hi, it's so good to be with you. Thanks for having me. So talk to us a little bit about, uh, you know, what we learn in the book. It just, you know, feels like uh, everything that we could possibly know we uh, learned on the TV show. <laughs> you definitely saw a little bit, but of course you can't see everything. You know, you only see a very little bit of, you know, the whole story, a very little bit of each person and what they believe and who they are. And so I wanted to put something out there that explained, you know, why I made the decisions that I made to go on the show, why I ultimately made the decision to leave the show and what life has been like since then, what I feel like, you know, I want to do with my life and how I can make a difference. And so made for this moment, I wrote really just to explain the story of the show, but also just to help, you know, readers and people to um, know who they are and to know that they were made on purpose and for a purpose to learn to love themselves, to learn to discover um, their identity and how to stand firm in their beliefs and in their values. And just for every single person to know that they were made for this moment in time. So that was kind of my heart behind writing this book. I always wonder watching, you know, when I've seen clips of The Bachelor, I keep thinking, who signs up for this? But then you are part of this <laughs> one scene that has never happened before, I don't think, where the mom come of The Bachelor comes on and says, yeah, I don't want you to end up with her. I mean, what a horrible thing you had to live through there. I mean, in addition to being on all the other regular Bachelor stuff, what was that like and how do you get through that? You know, I actually start off with my book talking about that actual moment because that was probably one of the hardest moments on the show. And so I start off my book talking about what it felt like at that Bachelor finale moment when I'm having, you know, words sent to me that were sent to berate me and tear yes. me down. And like an attack against you know my character and my faith and just who I am as a person and it was so difficult to be honest with you but I think I learned throughout the process what true courage looks like and sometimes it looks like you know speaking up and standing up for yourself and standing up for what you believe in and sometimes it's just remaining silent and just trusting that you know your character and so much more is going to defend itself and there's no need to you know fight back or to lash out or to defend and so in that moment I was able to really just fight my my tongue and keep my peace and hold my composure and just I don't trust, know how you, you know, did that my life is going to speak for itself <laughs> right I mean do you get in this kind of group think when you're all at I mean does everyone really love the bachelor I keep thinking I mean I mean every season everyone's just in love with them right from the the, the get-go you know, for me, I think what was difficult, so you even kind of mentioned this earlier, I actually did not know what I was signing up for. I had never seen the show before. I had my friends who signed me up. I kind of stepped into it, blind faith, just hopeful and not really knowing what to expect. And so it was kind of every moment was so new to me and I was learning something along the way each moment. And I think for me, it was really hard because I'm a very logical person. So I was constantly wrestling between my heart and my head, you know, my, my heart was feeling things but my head was like does this make sense do our values and beliefs and you know lifestyles align and so like you saw that clip at the beginning it was so crazy watching that back because I haven't seen it and so yeah it, it was it was a wild experience kind of that wrestle between your heart and your head you can uh, check out more on Madison's social media also her website uh, maddieprue.com and uh, the book is called uh, The Moment There as Made well. Made for this moment. Made for this moment. Madison, thank you so much for Thanks, joining Madison. us. Thanks, Madison. Yeah, thank you guys so much for having me.